Hi, I'm Tom from Ignite Digi, and here next to me I've got the Arctal 9x7 cinema camera system. This camera is the vision of Paul Arctal, an Australian-based cinematographer and director. His background is in engineering and in documentary filmmaking for large screen IMAX content. The camera is made up of two parts. So we've got the camera module up the front and the recording module at the back. And these are joined by high speed fiber to enable the high resolution capture. This camera is designed for ultra high resolution capture for giant screen, the MSG sphere, that sort of content. Earlier this year, Pavel approached us to optimize this camera for a more production style rig, which you can see here. So what we did was we made some adapters for the Komodo, Komodo X Keystone, which you can see here. So this Keystone is symmetrical and it uses the ARRI standard height for Mini and Mini LF. So the idea is that you can use the ARRI CCH2 up the top, you can use our bridge plate booster, you can use an ARRI BP8 or 9 down the bottom. So really standardizing it to an ARRI standard, which a lot of rental houses would have and a lot of owner ops will have. It may seem counterintuitive to build out a small camera module to a big camera cage, but the idea is it gives you space. So it gives you space for things like power breakouts and things like rod mounts if you need them. Up the back here, we've got the rod mount down the side, which enables us to mount the Teradek and the recording module. I'll just give you a quick run through of all the parts that make up this camera system. So at the bottom, we've got our ARRI dovetail, we've got our lens support, ARRI BP8, Ignite Digi booster seat, Ignite Digi keystone for Komodo and Komodo X, we've got the Ignite Digi power breakout, two pin Lemos, we've got Pavel's own two, two pin power breakout. And then inside here, we've got the nine by seven camera module. Up the top, we've got the ARRI CCH2, the Zagudo Chameleon, small HD Indy 7. And at the back, I'm just gonna spin it around. We've got the nine by seven recording module. We've got a couple of the Ignite Digi Cine Tape adapters just modified to allow the quarter inch to go through. We've got a Teradek down the side and then a 105 rod mount here, which allows that setup. You may be wondering where you can get some of these custom looking screws. These are Powell's own ceramic coated titanium. So reach out to Powell for some bolts. Okay. And then finally, we've got this wireless controller to help you navigate around the system menus. When rolling, the recording module runs at about 120 watts. That's why the V-Lock's on the back here. And then we're splitting out power from a D-Tap into the two pin here, and then out to the power breakout, which is then feeding the Zacuto, the monitor, the Teradek and the camera module. The Actual team have worked on this camera for the last three or four years and are continuing to do so in firmware and hardware upgrades. So if you're interested in this camera for your next giant screen or LED volume capture, then please reach out to Pavel on the link below. If you have any rigging questions about the camera, then feel free to reach out to me, tom at ignitedigi.com.au.